The connection that exists between Vault CDMS and Vault CTMS provides a natural and near real-time transfer of necessary data to speed up clinical processes and reduce the need for duplicate data entry. As users in both systems work to set up a new study, it is an option to select the study to be connected with the other Vault system. Any updates made in CTMS to that study data moving forward will be nearly immediately reflected in CDMS for sites to work with. This includes updates to metadata, lifecycle statuses, and new data altogether, such as new sites being built out and selected. As soon as those changes are made in one vault, they will trigger that data to be sent to the connected vault so that users may quickly begin to work with those updates. Users in Vault CDMS may now see those new or updated study sites to create new subjects or complete out visit forms according to the build out in their respective system. Similarly to the transfer of information from CTMS to CDMS, these new and updated subjects will now be reflected in Vault CTMS for CRAs to review from enrollment dashboards, payable item generations, and monitoring visits. All of this data can be utilized in normal CTMS business processes without the need to think about when the transfers occur or where the data is coming from. On the site page, subject data can be reviewed further or the clinical finance team can pick up the review of automatically generated payable items related to the completed visits and approved fee schedules. This data is now used for the generation of payment requests for all sites with no effort needed to gather transaction information. Simultaneously, CRAs can move through their next monitoring visit from their homepage, and any data needed will be apparent from one viewpoint, including that CDMS entered subject data. Continuing from this listing of subject data, CRAs will have a one-click option to review the subject visit forms directly in CDMS to collect SDV activity and subject level protocol deviations. Again, once completed in the CDMS vault, it is nearly immediately reflected in CTMS and can be shown on the CRA's in-progress trip report or used elsewhere in the CTMS system. The natural connection that can exist between Vault CDMS and Vault CTMS helps to speed up clinical processes and allow users to focus on their role rather than duplicate data entry.